Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Sanforia and we are once again playing Rune... What is that? We're playing RuneScape. I was so easily distracted. That's so silly. Um, so I have been, as you can see, doing lots of leveling. Um, I have been leveling, well, everything really. My magic's at 11. I got my crafting up to 31. Mining's now 19. I've been doing some rune crafting. Um, so I have actually been able to craft myself some spider silk robes. Um, that was what I wanted to do um, my crafting, not for, but I wanted to be able to make them myself. Um, so um, I did that. I've also been doing a lot of um, blah, 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 rune crafting so I could make lots of areas. Um, I'm starting to kind of sort my, my bank out, but not too much. And then... Um, yeah i've just done some bits and bobs and yeah just generally been kind of upping my skills um let's do strength cool uh, so as you saw as well in the bank um we have 3552 starlight ore um now this means that we do have enough to make like either boots or gloves um, but to me like the hood looks the coolest. I'm definitely gonna make something out of the magic. I think um, I'd love stuff like this, but I just there's like the bow looks awesome But there's no way I'm gonna get like 7,000 more um, And 2,000 of the ones that I've got were from a treasure hunter key um, So I'm not about to get any more so I'm gonna assume that once they stop giving them out from mining you can still make the stuff so I can kind of keep hold of it. I'm just going to pop it in the bank and then I can kind of keep hold of it there and decide later on like what I want to do with it and pick something. Um, but we're actually going to go back to Lumbridge, I believe, because that's where the quest is that we finish. Well, we, we began um, at the end of the last episode. Um kind of equipment wise nothing's changed um i did get a wizard hat like this lovely lady here is modeling this blue one um i do have one of them in the bank this one here too but um as of yet i don't think i can dye it so i don't want to wear it because it i could i could have worn it and just not had it on show but it wouldn't have been the same i wanted to wear one so so these are just what we've done okay so what we're gonna do is open up our quest guide and we are doing Myths of the White Lands. So Explorer Jack has told me that the riches await in the land of the snow. I should find out more from Explorer Jack. So let's go back to his house and see what he has to say. Are you in here, Jack? What's this? It looks like coins on the floor. Can I take them? Donnie gonna shout at me. Boop. Nope. Hey, grab the cash. <laughs> I like that. We do have quite a bit more money now. We have 27,000 because of me crafting stuff and selling it. So that's pretty cool. Um, the other thing is though. Uh, we seem to have like no audio. That's weird. Um, I don't know what's going on with the sound. But here... So Explorer Jack, um, look what the builders have done. Yeah, we know about this. Uh, about Mists of the White Lands. Um, I can see you have a query. Please ask away. How do I get there? Um, he's uh, An acquaintance lives in the wizard's tower. He's called Isador. He'll take you there as long as you give him the teleport phrase. But you'll have to remind him every time. Poor chap has memory like a sieve. That's what you get from experimenting with magic all day. I say with a wand in my hand. Yeah, of course. What's the teleport phrase? Oh yes, of course, it's Ectosum Glissendo. That's what the snow imp said. How do you know that the imp's tale is true? I could see truthfulness in his eyes. Could it have been greed? Well, if it was greed, then those riches are definitely valuable. Bring it back. Okay, so we need to go to the wizard's tower. So luckily I went around as well and collected almost, well, I say collected, um, activated almost all of the lodestones. Um, I think there's only Edgeville and um, Alcarid that we don't have. 
So that's that's helpful. See where we are. So we are here. We need to go. Oh, we should have teleported to Draenor. A port to Draenor. I can't remember which how far over it was. Ugh. So let's just quickly teleport to Draenor as we're surrounded by goblins and rats and Oh well, dude, I thought it was. I kept, um, when I was going south of Falador, I kept getting attacked by muggers and things, and it was horrible. Um, also, apologise, because I feel like I have quite a bit of a husky voice. Um, I am still poorly. I do have a cold um, and a sore throat. Which I got off my lovely daughter, so thanks for that. But hey ho. We can work through it. So, we just need to go south. Um, I don't think there's anything else we need. Um, I've got the air runes just so we can cast a spell. Uh, but I don't think there's anything we need. Ooh, look at all the divination orb things. Paley wisps. Let's go to the wizard's tower, which now looks awesome, by the way. It's not just like a... Not that it was like a mangy tower or anything before. That sounds so bad. But the old wizard's tower was nowhere near as cool as this one. Um, we do have quests in here that we can do that we've done bef- that I- oh, well, obviously I've done them all before, but, uh, most of them anyway. With her and things, but we, uh, we won't be starting those yet. Um, I don't want to start a load of quests and then have to kind of, like, go back and do them. I'd rather just, um, come and do them when I need them. So, I'm sure he said his name was Isidore. So it's not him. There's no one else here. Okay, let's go upstairs and see if the um, the blue square is from upstairs as well. Because it could possibly be. See, doesn't this look amazing? Look at all the little... Look at them in there. They just look so cool. Where's eyes? I don't know. That's not him. Uh, have I gone to the wrong side? Yeah, I have. There's our wizard. Oh, hello there. Can I do anything for you? Uh, I'm a friend of Explorer Jackson. You're transporting. The phrase is Ectosum Glissendo. Could you help me, please? Very well, then. Here you go. Ectosum Glissendo. I hope you guys can hear that. That was voice acted. I'm a little bit worried because the, the, the whole thing's been a bit messed up. Okay, so we are here outside of a lovely cave that we have to try and get into. Um, okay. Right, okay, let's... Let's go this way. Slip, slip, slip. Let's go this way. And then this way. And then we can go up here. Cool. And then let's squeeze through the cave entrance. Squeezing in. Okay, so we are inside this area, um, and basically, I think it's a load of like puzzles and stuff. I think they're all like this, to a degree. Um, oh, I may have just gone wrong. Did I go wrong? Uh, I don't know. No, 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 no. We're fine. Um, yeah, I can't remember how to do these. Or which way we need to go so we are definitely winging it <laughs> um because i have no idea can i just not walk can i not just like, like walk in how do i get in ah, um how do i how do i do this just to go in Go inside. Um, I feel like I need to. How would I get there though? I need to be like there, 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 there. My goodness. Okay. Um. Okay. I told you I hadn't done this in so long. Right. Where do I need to be? So confused, so I need to be there. There. Which means I need to be there maybe? 
which is there, which is what? I may have to. <laughs> this is only the first one, and I can't do it. Oh my goodness. Right, okay, let's just go straight ahead. Okay, let's go this way. Um, if I go this way, if I go there, and there, maybe. Let's try this. Pretty sure you can go diagonals as well, but I'm not 100% how. I think I think we got it. I think we got it. Yay! <laughs> the first one I nearly failed. Okay, so. Uh huh, okay. So there are some bits and bobs up here that I probably need. Uh, let's go this way first. Okay, down onto this platform. Maybe it's just from platform that I can go down, or maybe. I don't know. Uh, oh no, I can just go there. Okay, that was a silly move. Come on, all the way back. All the way back. Okay. Back up. And back down across to this one. Thank you. Clear the wall. Uh, clear the wall. There we go. Okay, so we've got some crazy picture. Thanks. Thanks for that, dude. Okay, my crafting went up to <laughs> 32 for some reason. Who knows? Okay, so I can only assume that we have to kind of go back. Up here, maybe? That seems to be the only way back. If I go this way, I'm gonna go right to the end, aren't I? Ah, okay. Um, can I not go diagonal? I was sure I could go diagonal. I can't see! I knew it! I knew it! But now I'm, I'm kind of stuck now. Uh, it's very hard to get this diagonal thing going though. No, no, no. Switch button runs all the way back. Right, I'm gonna pause here and I'll come back to you guys when I get into the next room. Okay guys, so I did it with some crazy like bouncing off a wall thing. Um, not too sure how I did it to be fair, but hey ho, what does it matter? We did it. So to get to this one, kind of have to go up the ramp um I can only assume that we have to use these because I can't otherwise see why they'd be there although that does block that diagonal path um oh I think we have to go all the way around I think that's why that one's there let's try Although that bit doesn't look like ice, that shouldn't have stopped us. Ugh. Okay, maybe we should... No, not diagonal. Maybe go this way. Let's see what happens. That's better, yay! Okay, you kind of get your head in the zone a bit, I guess. And realise what you're trying to... What the kind of... You know, once you do one, you're a bit... Um, uh -huh, okay. So let's just go for it. Alright, okay, so we're there. We need to, like, be on the other side of this, though. That isn't very helpful. Okay, this is just going to take us right the way back around. We have to go back. Oh, can we get it? No! Go back! Go diagonal. No! Okay, I'm gonna cut back to my back because this is really starting to drive me crazy. Okay, so I got through that one. It only took a couple of minutes to actually get it to work. Even though it was driving me nuts. And like I said, it's just more of the same. Yay. So let's just let's go a bit nuts and just go for it again. Because I just... This is probably not what I should be doing when I feel so ill.
<laughs> That's probably why I'm a bit like, you know what, meh. To see what happens. Diagonally. No! Every time. It is so hard sometimes to get the diagonals on this thing to work. It drives me up the wall. Although that one probably isn't a diagonal if you look at it properly. Um, okay. Oh, now I'm kind of stuck. Right, this video is running a bit long now and this is just driving me crazy. So I'm going to leave this video here. Um, probably shouldn't be recording when I'm ill. That probably doesn't help my patients. But hey-ho. Um, I hope you've enjoyed it. Um, we're going to just continue this in the next episode. I am going to actually try and do... I can't remember how many of these rooms there are um, on this quest. So I'm just going to try and like get through them first myself and then just kind of join back with you guys when I'm at like the final room or anything interesting happens. So um, I hope to see you all soon. Bye guys!